Welcome to my latest painting update. Um, no idea what number this one is. I don't have my list with me. Uh, but this one covers October 2021. I spent most of uh, October, as you can see, painting my Nog in the Nog miniatures, which I got from, uh, from a Kickstarter. For those of you that may have had a deficient childhood, uh, Nog in the Nog uh, was a cartoon uh, created by Oliver Postgate, who also did Bagpuss and um, Over the Engine, so like, uh, and The Clangers, uh, which aired um, on British TV uh, in the early 70s. Noggin himself um, was a Northman who went on various um, adventures, uh, which were told in these sagas. So, um, as you can see, quite a sizable collection of Noggin figures. Um, I'm not going to pick them all out. I'll I'll just uh, I'll just highlight a few. So this is Noggin himself, fine little chap. He's uh, he's our hero, and he's up against the main villain, who is this chap, who is Nogbad the Bad. Yeah, see, it all makes sense. Um, and so there are various, uh, various soldiers that support Noggin. That's there. Um, as well as, uh, the king and queen, which are, the king's his father. The king actually dies in the first episode. So, um, but, you know, there he is. Um. And the Queen. And various other bits and pieces. Um, townsfolk, princesses, that sort of thing. Um, and then there's a couple of little speciality sets I got. Um, there's the chess match here between Noggin and Nog... Nog Noggin and Nogbad. Um, with a pile of sandwiches in the foreground because that was very important to the um, to the story, if I remember rightly, which I probably don't because it was many, many years ago. And then there's this Eastern set with... Um, I have no idea who this guy is, to be honest. I don't remember this episode. But there's a chap on his throne, a couple of um, eunuch guards, another chap in a flying saucer. I got it for this piece, this this sort of... Jin is I just think it's a brilliant little figure. Loved it. Um, and then down here is a couple of clangers, which in Noggin were called moon mice and were later turned into their own, they had their own uh puppet animatronic, not animatronic, stop motion uh puppet series. The other speciality noggin set I got were the trolls who are on my bridge here. So um I think these are great. I mean, I'm going to use most of these figures in normal role-playing games. Um, there's a troll. There's a, there's a troll on a giant rat. Troll cavalry, I suppose. Uh, and then, um, perhaps weirdest of all, there uh, is a troll lady. There are double-sided trolls. Um, he's a single-sided troll. And he's a double-sided troll. And I don't remember the trolls either. I've, I've recently bought the series on DVD, so I'm going to have to obviously go and have a look. It wasn't all uh, nogs, though. Um, I also um, painted up uh, an extra Russian infantry general, officer, doesn't have to be a general. Um, I had him in a draw, and we decided uh, the Russians needed more command points for the... Uh, for the Crimea game, which you can see we're um, we're actually filming in the uh, in the remains of the Crimea game. I've just shoved everything out of the way. Um, there's Kevin. She's a princess. Over my dead British. Very embarrassing. Still, I did win. Just okay. So I did the general, and uh, I did this bridge. It was the first thing I painted. Let's get the trolls out of the way. So this is an Italieri plastic kit. It's marketed by Warlord as a as a 
28 mil one. It clearly isn't 28 mil. It's clearly designed for 20 mil figures. But um, this was about 12 pound off eBay. Um, I think they're meant to be about 15 quid. But easy to make and, and quite a decent bridge. Um, I have a new river system and I need some flat bridges. There'll be more on that when I get around to using it. Um, okay, so that was most of October. What isn't here is I've painted uh, 18 Langstech pikemen, um, but they're not based because I've got to do 18 more before I can assemble the, the four units. Um, so they'll be in next month's update. Um, so I think altogether in October, I did, um, I think came out to about 64 miniatures. Okay, that's it. Just a quick update this month. Um, as always, thank you for watching. Please um, tell your friends how brilliant my channel is. Like, subscribe, hit the bell, leave a comment, all the all the usual YouTube stuff. Um, it'll help my, my channel grow. Um, I'm not sure what I'll do when it's grown, but it's a good thing, right? So, um, okay, that being said, as always, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.